guys, it's Danny, and today I've got a little, like a small polish haul for you guys. Um, but first, I wanted to talk a little bit about what is on my face. Um, this wasn't planned, I just decided that I wanted to play around a little bit with my new Urban Decay Gwen Stefani palette that I got, that I hauled the other day. And I really wanted to try out some of the lipstick samples that came with the palette and that I got. Again, this is the palette. Very neutral. And I did do a little bit of an eye look. Like, not much. Just something really neutral. And, you know, I put some of the sparkly shades in there, but it doesn't seem to... You know, like I put, um... What was the color I used? I used the Baby and Steady. They're two really, really, like, metallic-y shades. I put them, like, both in the corners and like you can't even really tell but I was just playing around with it and I actually I really do like like the overall look of the eyes but I also decided I wanted to try one of the um, lipstick samples I got and the one that I'm actually wearing that I actually ended up going with is Firebird which looks like that in the thing and this on the lips and I actually really, really, really love it. I wasn't expecting to like this color. I just wanted to do something kind of crazy and outside of my comfort zone. Because I, if you watch me, you know when I wear makeup, my lips are always nude. Like, my favorite lipstick of all time and the one I wear 90% of the time when I wear lipstick is Liar by Urban Decay. Because it is my favorite lipstick and it's just a nudie pinky brown. I will say, like, I had to use, like, a cheap little flimsy lip brush to do this since it's in this and not a lipstick so it does kind of look it's a little bit messy like I it's eh, you know what I mean but I really like this color and I actually might buy it I even sent my husband a picture and he likes it so hmm the color I put on first that I ended up taking off because I hated it is this one called seismic and it looks like it's gonna be this beautiful shimmery like really dark like black cherry color but it's a it's a real it's a sheer and I just didn't like it I'm gonna swatch it so you guys can see but like it's a sheer and see like that's what it looks like on my finger it's just it's too sheer and I probably could like, if I wanted to sit there for six hours or whatever, I could make it really dark. I just didn't like it. So, honestly, I'm probably just going to throw this sample away because I'm not going to use it. But if, you know, a color, a sheared color like this is what you're looking for, go for it. But I just didn't care for that. So, on to the actual haul. Because, <laughs> like, we're already three minutes into the video and all I did was talk about lipstick. And that's not even what this video is about. So... But I got three new Linderella polishes because I love Linderella. She is like my favorite brand. Like if you look right here, this is my Linderella rack and it's like almost full. And then this one's my Enchanted rack and you know, Linderella and Enchanted are my two favorite brands but Enchant or, um, Linderella honestly is a lot easier to get a hold of um, than enchanted can be sometimes and I don't know it always feels like the enchanted restocks when they happen they happen at really bad times for me so I'm not able to um, partake and you know enchanted restocks are usually over very quick so if you don't have it like that day you're not getting it you know and that's what's kind of sad as to where Linderella you know are pretty readily available anyway I got three new ones <laughs> The very first one is, I'm so super excited about it, it's called On the Dot with the Sky Blues. And it's a glitter topper and it's beautiful and I don't know if it's going to focus, but down the bottom it tells me what number I have because this is a, this was like a one of someone's custom and there was only 10 bottles made and I have the fifth bottle. So, but I freaking love it. It's gorgeous. And then I have this one, 
which is called Hexy Hexen Beast, and it is part of a duo that she offered around Halloween time that I really, really, really wanted. Um, but she sold out of like the duos, but she still had, I guess, like this one, but she didn't have any more of the orange because it came with like an, a really pretty orange color. And I guess she doesn't. I guess she doesn't have any more of the orange color, she, but she saw some of these, so they were selling these like individually. So I just got this one and hope, you know, maybe I'll be able to find somebody that's like selling the one that went with it. And this one's really, really pretty. It's really pretty. And then the third one I got, um, I'm actually really excited about because it's a thermal and I love thermals. I don't have any water to like test the thermal out, but when I actually wear it, um, I'll probably do a demo. And it's called Everland, and it's this really pretty blue. And then when it gets warm, it turns like lighter blue. It's like a really, um, it's not a super, it's like subtle. That's the word I was looking for. It's a sub, more of a subtle transition because it just turns into like a lighter version of this almost white. But it's super pretty. And this again is called Everland. I love Linderell polishes. Okay, so that's all my polishes. Um, my nails right now, I have... I'm getting ready to change them because they're all chipped all to hell. And I wanted... I was thinking about maybe doing something cutesy for 4th of July weekend. Um, which might be over by the time I've, I upload this, I don't know. Um, but this color is Water for Unicorns by Enchanted, and I did change my nail shape. I now have kind of like a stiletto shape going on, because I love stilettos. I've had them before, but like I absolutely love them. They need a little bit more work, honestly, like in the shaping department before they're to where I, will, to where I really like them, but it's a start. So, but I will talk to everyone later, and um... Any feedback on like the lip color on me, greatly appreciated. Um, I want to know what you guys think of it. I like it, but you know how sometimes you like something but you really can't pull it off? I don't know. I, I kind of, I'm digging it, but I just, I don't know yet. You know what I mean? I'm thinking about buying a full size of this lipstick. I really like it. Alright then, I'll talk to everyone later. Bye!